The opinions expressed in the video you are about to see are solely those of Botest.com and its test captain. Captain Bob Smith, Director of Testing. Welcome to Botest.com. I'm back in Sanibel, Florida with Formula once again. This year they got a great option for you. If the 310 Sun Sport's gotten too small and the 370 is a little too big to jump into, we got the 350 Sun Sport for you now. She's a great day boat, plus she's got overnight accommodations. Let's jump on board and take a look at the features of the 350 Sun Sport from Formula. You aren't going to sacrifice style or performance when you buy the 350 Sun Sport. This hot model is designed to deliver style, grace, and speed to the family who wants it all. It carries a 10-year structural hull warranty, transferable 5-year Formula Guard Limited Protection Plan, and striking graphics. Getting to the bow, you climb easily up three molded in steps in the dash with dual stainless grab rails and pass through a large walkthrough with unique locking mechanism. At the bow, there are low rails, an optional remote spotlight, and under the cover is an optional Lumar electric windlass with chain counter. The bird's eye view shows lots of seating so your friends and family can enjoy the view ahead or huddle up to plan the next meal in the aft cockpit. Seating includes a split command helm bench with bolsters, portside lounger, and large wraparound aft settee. Six marine speakers include separate tweeters for that sweet sound from your tunes aboard. In the port side is a molded in wet bar with Corian top, concealed trash bin, and sink. Below is a storage locker with battery switches and breakers, and on the other side is a 36 quart igloo cooler where you can opt for this nice isotherm drawer style refrigerator. One really cool feature is this aft bench converts into a huge sun pad to relax at anchor. The command center has burlwood accents, complete with Lavorsi instrumentation and Raymarine ST60 digital depth gauges standard. With our Merc cruisers, we also had Mercury Smartcraft and digital throttle and shift. Another popular option are the Raymarine color chart plotters. If you opt for the generator, it fits in the aft sole locker. I was impressed with the detail, noise suppression, and how lines were led through the conduits, keeping it neat. Access to the twin 496 mag HOs is through an electric hatch giving easy access to standard checkpoints. Now, of course when the light starts getting low and you decide to spend the night out on the hook, the 350 Sunsport offers you a nice cabin inside. Now, let's go inside and take a look at those features there, but before we do, take a look at the cabin door. It's really neat too. It's got a nice hard cabin door, but then you've also got a screen door enclosure, so if you don't want to run the AC or you don't want to have the AC option, you still have a chance to have some nice cooling air brought through the cabin. As you enter the cabin, a cedar line closet is to starboard and the aft cabin stateroom is behind you. The berth is full size with memory foam mattress. The large mirror really makes this a huge feeling cabin. The galley is forward of the berth on the port side with cherry wood accents. Upper cabinets include storage and tap and microwave. The countertop has open storage access across the back, concealed trash bin, concealed single burner cooktop, and large polished stainless steel sink. The isotherm refrigerator is just across on the port side. Forward is an ultra leather sofa with dual height table. You can remove the table, add the table, or drop it down and convert this into a large V berth. On the starboard side above the refrigerator is an entertainment center with optional sharp LCD TV with DVD, standard Kenwood stereo, and pivoting out the TV, you access the power panel with bright LED lighting and optional iPod cradle. Just to starboard as you enter the cabin is the enclosed head with vacuum flush toilet, separate pull out shower in the Corian vanity top, sink, and faucet. Access to the spacious swim platform is through a port side walkthrough where you find the swim shower and a Kenwood stereo remote. Our test boat had the optional teak grain vinyl for a really rich look. In the center of the platform is a concealed four step swim ladder and over on the starboard corner are all the shore connections and a fender and line locker. The 350 Sunsport measures 35 feet length overall with a 10 foot 9 inch beam and weighs approximately 12,950 pounds dry. The 350 Sunsport handled the action around Sanibel with ease and delivered a smile inducing ride. Smooth turns and easy acceleration were trademarks. I found she was on plane in 6.5 seconds and reached a cruise at 3000 RPMs and 31.1 miles per hour. She reached a maximum speed of 56.8 miles per hour powered with twin C-Core 496 mag HOs from her cruiser. Well in typical formula style, the 350 Sunsport really fills that gap between the 310 and the 370, giving the day boater a great boat to go out for during the day, as well as overnight accommodations if you'd like to spend the night on the hook. Be sure and take a look at the 350 Sunsport from Formula.